everybody welcome back to my channel for those who are new to my channel i am key and this is keys playing life so it has been a long time since we have done one of these videos but we are going to do some cash envelope stuffing y'all i'm back on the cash envelope stuffing now um what i do want to tell you guys is after i stuff these envelopes i will be putting this money in the bank just because a lot of this money can be building interest because some of these are sinking funds and some of these are cash envelopes i will let you know what's a sinking fund and i will let you know what's cash envelope for everyday spending but um a lot of this will be going into my um savings account and then another one the rest of it will be going on um in the bank account in my bank account so all together we have taken out 230 dollars i went to my bank took out $230 so let's count it so I like my money to be set put a certain way so we have 2 4 6 8 10 20 so that is 120 and then we have 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 so you're probably like where is the 230 well excuse me y'all i have 40 dollars here that i need to get change for so i'm going to take a 10 and that'll be my 10 and that goes there so there we go um we're gonna start off by putting everything in sections right now there is nothing in these cash envelopes so we're gonna take them out and i'm gonna try to put them in order order that i'm gonna be stuffing them in so we have household and then little red Hold on. A little red. And then we have gas. I thought I had one that said gas. I do. Um, and then we have Keys Care. And then we have Audrey. And then we have car maintenance. And then we have eating out. It's supposed to be an F right here. It's supposed to say fur baby, so uh tokyo and then i think that is it we're not stuffing <coughs> we're not doing groceries and we're not doing fun money so let's get started with what we are doing i'm gonna put those here and here let me bring it down a little bit hopefully you can see it um put this envelope to the side Okay, so the first thing we're going to be doing is stuffing household. Household will get $20. So we're going to put $20 in household. Yeah, I haven't used these things in so long due to the COVID situation. But I said I have to get back to... Um, being financially responsible and this is one way of helping me do that so i'm going to turn it upside down so it can remain in the order um the next one is little red he gets 25 dollars, but i don't have a five so since his sister gets um 25 dollars as well i'm just going to take a 10 and when i deposit it into the account i'll um split the fives up in between so his will get 30 and then I'll just go in and split it once we get to the bank. See, if you haven't done this in a while, this thing is it closes now. And that's going to their savings account. Um, this is the money that when they graduate, it's theirs. It's going to build interest. It's getting dividends because it's where we belong to a credit union. Um, the next thing we have going on is gas. So gas gets $40. Let 
So I'm going to take 120 and two tens. Sit that there. Open this. Don't ask me why I'm having to do that because I have no idea why it's doing that. The next thing was Audrey, no, Keys Care. Keys Care gets $50. And I don't have a thing for that. But this doesn't matter because this is actually going to just go in my purse because I'm going to get my nails done today. Um, the next thing is Audrey. So we're going to stuff Audrey's in. As you know, she's normally supposed to get 25, but I have to break that 10 up amongst her and her brother. So she's getting 25. Um, let's see what's next. Car maintenance. Car maintenance is getting $20. And I decided to bring back car maintenance because every three months my car needs an oil change and this will help save for that. Well, not every three months, but every six months. It needs a car, it needs an oil change, uh, um, air filter, and tire rotations, and this will cover that. Eating out. Eating out is going to get $30. So we're going to take that. And this is for if we just go and we buy maybe pizza or something, or we might go get some hamburgers. This even covers our little trips to American Deli that we make. Um, let's see, our last but not least is Firestone. I mean, uh, the dog fund. So the dog fund gets $20. So this covers his, this doesn't cover his preventive care because that's just a monthly bill. What this covers is his toys, his treats, um, and his food. So that's what that covers. And he won't need food for a while because what I do is when I buy his food, I buy the huge, huge, huge bags. So it typically takes him almost four or five if not six months to finish that bag because he's a toy dog so he doesn't eat as much so i'll definitely be able to save on this so that is our cash envelopes and our sinking funds so you're probably wondering what is a sinking which one is sinking and which one is cash envelopes so i can tell you this is cash envelopes these to me are sinking funds slash savings this is a um cash envelope because this is my gas this is a cash envelope this is a savings this is um cash envelopes this is uh no that's a sinking this is cash envelopes and this is cash envelopes but this can go in both categories this could be a sinking fund as well as a cash envelope but i'm going to make it a cash envelope because we do like buy him treats and things every couple of months um and we also like he had a halloween costume this year why don't ask me why i bought him the halloween costume but i did <laughs> so he has a halloween costume um so that would typically come out of that fun so i hope you guys enjoyed this um cash envelope stuffing slash sinking fund stuffing um we're back doing these again i cannot wait um so so far all we what we have saved in these each fund is what we put up today where our goal is to build these funds and um see how much we can um put in each one of them and see if we even utilize everything in there now each one of these funds ha does have a limit um for them so once it if once we reach that limit of stuffing then i stop um because it does have a limit on how much we're stuffing in there um and how much needs to be in each envelope or needs to be in the account for it to be complete so yeah, I am about to get out of here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to think smart and spend smarter and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Budget for February, our goals for February. Um, 
what I plan on doing different for February. So this is our February um, 